quadrilater A, B, C, D is translated 10 units left and 2 units down to create quadrilateral A prime, B prime, C prime, D prime, which will describe this transformation. So 10 units left is X minus 10 and 2 units down is Y minus 2. Write the rule for this translation. Slide 3 up and 2 right. So 3 up is uh, y plus 3 and 2 right is x plus 2. After a translation, figures are no longer for a congruent. False. Determine how to translate triangle A prime B prime C prime to triangle A B C. So over here, if you look closely, uh, you have to move. I'll choose point A prime. So I'll move this point by two units to the right. So one, two, and then I'll count down to reach this point. So one. 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So it is right 2 and down 9. How is triangle ABC being translated to triangle A prime B prime C prime? So for example if I choose the point of C, I can count all the way from this point to this point by counting on the x, uh, uh, x coordinate plane first. So 1, 2, 3, 4, right, and then we can go down. So this is uh, right 4. So this is uh, down. We can go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we can say it is right 4 and down 9. So we can search and we will get this one. What transformation is happening? X y x plus two comma y minus three. So this will become a uh, slide right 2 and this one will become slide down 3. So slide right 2 down 3. When translating left or right on a coordinate plane, what coordinate is affected? X coordinate, Y coordinate. So uh, left or right is x-coordinate what is the algebraic representation of a figure is translated 6 units right and 5 units up so 6 units right is x plus 6 5 units up is y plus 5 How is triangle ABC being translated to triangle A prime, B prime, C prime? Um, I'm going to choose this C point again and uh, we'll make it reach C prime. So 
let's count we will go down by 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and then we will move to the right by 1 2 3 4 5 sorry 4 um down 9 right 4 What does a translation do to a figure on the coordinate plane? Does it slide it, flip it, shrink it, or rotate it? Slide it. Determine how to tr uh, translate triangle A prime, B prime, C prime to triangle ABC. So X plus 2 uh, if I choose point a prime that is you can choose any of the three points so I'll choose a prime uh, x plus 2 because you're sliding uh, on the right side uh, by two units so yeah and then you go down so it's y minus 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so it's x plus 2 y minus 9 Describe the translation that maps triangle I R T to triangle I prime R prime T prime. For example, if I choose the point R, you can choose um, I or T if you want. So I will go. Um, let's see. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six units on the right, and then. 1, 2, 3, 4 units down. So 6 units right, 4, 6 units up, 4 units left. 6 units right, 4 units down. This one. What does a translation do to an image? Mirror, shrink, slide, turn it 90 degree clockwise. Slide it. Triangle XYZ is translated three units up and four units to the right to create triangle X prime, Y prime, Z prime, which rule describes the transformation. So if you go three units up, which is nothing but uh, Y plus three and four units to the right, which is nothing but X plus four. So X plus four, Y plus three. A slide is also called a reflection, translation, rotation, transformation. A slide is also called a translation. Write the rule for this translation. Slide 5 up and 7 right. So 5 up is y uh, plus 5 and 7 right is x plus 7. So this one. Describe the rule x, y, x minus 4, y plus 6. So x minus 4 will be slide 4 units left and y plus 6 will be slide 6 units up. So you will be left with this option. Describe the translation that maps point Q to point Q prime. Now initially I was about to say that uh, you can choose any of the three points from the triangle, the original one. You can choose point P, you can choose point R, you can choose point Q. But since the question says point Q specifically, I prefer if you guys don't choose point P or R. So uh, first you go, hmm, let's see. First, you go one, two units up. Uh, you can do it in any order you like. You can move to the right first. You can move to the 
you know you can move up first it totally depends on which uh, plane you want to work on um so i'll go to the um to the up first so one two uh so you have um how many you have uh two units to hmm two units to uh, go up and then you have one two three four five six seven units on the right write the rule for this translation slide 3 up and 2 right so 3 up is y plus 3 and 2 right is x plus 2 so it's this one be careful with the uh, plane that you're talking about because it can get very confusing determine where x prime would be if you translated 3 units to the left and 9 units down so where would x prime be let's see x prime would be translated 3 units to the left so you go 1 2 3 and then 9 units down so this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so you are left with let's see the point over here so this is um minus 4 and wait i'm still confused um oh so i'm so sorry three units to the left yeah so 1 2 3 and then you go for nine units down so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so this is um this is uh what point is that let me check is this minus 4 minus 4 this is no it's not minus 4 minus 4 so is minus 4 and minus 5 hmm write a rule for the translation so again you can choose any of the three points from the original triangle it's not uh, specified that you have to use a specific point to you know uh, translate the triangle so i will choose b and then i will translate it and i will make it reach b prime make sure whatever point you use you want to reach that point's prime so you cannot take a and then want to reach c prime no if you take a you have to reach its prime so which is a prime if you take b you have to take b prime if you take c you have to take c prime so just be careful okay so if i take b for example so x uh, will be 1 2 x plus 2 because you're going on the right um and then you'll go down one so that is x plus 2 y minus 1 determine how to translate triangle a prime b prime c prime to triangle a b c so you can take any point i'll take a so oh sorry i'll take a prime so i'll go 1 2 on the x coordinate plane and i will go to the right and then i'll go 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 uh units down so this will be x plus 2 and y minus 9 so you have to find it and select it translate the blue shape in uh, to the green shape so be careful which color you translate because you want to be very careful while translating you don't want to do it vice versa you don't want to translate the green shape into the blue shape because then you're going to get the whole answer wrong so just take your time so if you want to uh, 
translated i am not going to choose a specific point uh, because uh, there are no points over here it's just uh, you know a question of shapes so you want to go 1 2 3 uh, units to the uh, three units to the left and then you go 1 2 3 units down so you have to choose whatever once you got i got this one so triangle rst is translated 6 units to the right and 4 units down to create triangle r prime s prime uh, t prime which will describe this transformation so 6 uh, units to the right is x plus uh 6 and 4 units down is y minus 4 so x plus 6 y minus 4 a transformation in which a graph or geometric figure is picked up and moved to another location without any change in size or orientation this is called a translation when translating up or down on the coordinate plane which is basically vertically uh, what coordinate is affected y coordinate after a translation figures face the same direction but have a different size and shape no that is false they have the same size and shape Identify the transformation from A B C to A prime B prime C prime. So I will choose point A for this. You can choose B or C if you like. Um. Um. So let's see. We will go one, two, three, four, five, six units. Oh, sorry, not six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight units to the right. Please be careful while doing this because you don't want to choose A and then want to go to B prime. No, you have to. If you choose A, you have to go to A prime. You have to go to its prime. You you not go to any other alpha of its prime. So it's eight to the right. Uh, so eight units right would be x plus eight. And then one, two, three, four units up. Which is y plus four. So this one, and also be careful, as I said before, with the x and the y's because you don't want to mix the coordinates up. What does this transformation say to do? X comma y is equal to x comma y plus four. Now keep in mind that the x coordinate in this question is not getting affected, so you have to move up or down in this answer because the y coordinate is the one getting affected, and you're going on a positive note, so you're going. Uh, Four units up because it says y, so it means up or down. You go vertically, and then plus four, which is basically uh, going up, not down, because it's not minus four. So you go uh, up by four because it's a positive four. Define translation: the process of moving objects with a slide from one place to another. the process of rotating objects in various degrees the process of dilating geometric shapes it's the first one 